Oh hey, there's a new alpha out. I don't actually know what the what the thing you're supposed to do with the new al what, what what I actually do to get into the thing. And also, like, come on, work for me, controller. No, the controller is not deciding to work. Ah, oh, give me a second. Let me go get a different um, go get a different con the, 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 the controller wire wire thing. It's called a wire. So extremely unprepared for the stream. But at the same time, I am also doing this uh, significantly earlier than usual. So, whatever. It's fine. Yeah, just get that. And uh, no, well, well, we're, we're just waiting for this stuff. As it is, I don't really know. Like I said, I don't know where I'm going. Don't know what I'm doing here. It's supposed to be some kind of new area for testing out things. But I don't, I don't know. Oh, look. What does that mean? <laughs> I guess I'll figure it out in about five seconds here. And then I'm guessing that it, it seems like there is a large area down below that I'm probably going to be looking at. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'll do a regular run for right now. Then I can go figure out like what all the new stuff is once people manage to make it in here or something. I don't know. Uh meantime ah yes hello everybody there's new updates although it doesn't it, it seems like it's mostly just you know updates where it's a bunch of uh up, like the, like not uh, major content to the game just like uh d d testing testing rooms which is probably good but you know an expert such as myself what's up with your voice what do you mean it's the same as always same as it ever was What's up with my voice? I don't know. I now self-conscious about that. Um, why? What? What do you think is up with my voice? Um, uh, no, obviously not. Anyway, he's just excited. <laughs> excited about what? Not excited about it. Did you read the patch notes? Of course not. I don't read things. That's for fools. No. Oh. Anyway, try that one again. Give us dirt rally. Oh, come on. I got. I still have so much more persona to do and everything. It's like, how can I do dirt rally for right now? So important for me to continue to do a series that nobody likes forever. What's new in the alpha? Uh, it seems like it's a lot of stuff related to basically giving you ways to test out some content. I'm gonna start checking it out, but first off, since I'm, you know, it's gonna be like, you know, YouTube style, I want to, uh, wait until the notification goes out on Twitch for a few more people. That sort of thing. Because, as always, it does take a moment sometimes. Alright. The Twink cast? What the hell is that? Oh, yeah, remember King's Quest? Right. I was supposed to do that, too. And it sound younger? I don't know. If anything, I would think I would sound older every day. Like that that uh, uh, They Might Be Giants song. You know, what's up with your voice? I don't know. I do, somebody else asked me that too. What does that even mean? Could you elaborate? Uh, they Might Be Giants is a sort of like... God, I don't even know how I would describe it. Uh, indie... Almost novelty band that... Uh, at least as of right now has been doing a lot of kids songs. But in the past has just done a lot of very like strange things. I mean, uh, you are being recorded? No, I'm not. Not in that way, at least. Not in the way that I'm talking about right now. Don't say anything weird. It's like, what? What do you? Who is recording me? Oh, I mean about the alpha. I know about giants. Oh, okay. Well, then I mean, it's like, what else can I say? 
I don't know. It's it's gonna be a lot of like self discovery for me too. Uh, is that the is that the phrase I wanted to use? Um, no. But uh, it's gonna be a lot of discovery figuring out exactly what is new for me because all I know is that there's you know like testing arenas and places that you can kind of figure out how to fight different enemies or use different weapons in a non you know die and the game's over sort of scenario. All that sort of thing. All right. Still never found out exactly what the Twink Cast was. About, like, stars? <laughs> Wait, where's the necklace? I missed the necklace. Uh, I'll upload a voice comparison. I don't... Like, are you accusing me of not... Of, of being, like, an imposter in real life? <laughs> I just... I don't... Now I'm scared. Wait, is that why I'm told not to... Is it because you thought... It, are, are you suspicious of me having... <laughs> you are on YouTube. Am I on YouTube? Wait, what? why am I on YouTube? Wait a second. Yeah. Oh, right. That happens the first time that you go... What's this? Oh. A little bit too late now. Um... Okay. Sus. <laughs> Sus. Uh, okay, why'd, why'd they change? I can't say for... Wait, what? Oh, there was a cover, but I like the original. But come on, Tiny Toons. Oh, they, 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 they might be giants. Anyway, <laughs> I'm trying to... I'm getting very confused. Anyway, um... Yeah. <sighs> The voice different now. I do, now that's the only thing I can think about. Well, anyway, I don't know. I don't know why it's different. That's a lie. I do know. It's because I was drinking last night. Anyway, um, <laughs> while I was recording the Horizon episode again, uh, but that's um, that has nothing to do with anything. I don't know why that's becoming a regular thing now. Uh, Saucy Daka, shut up. It's fine. Thank you, Johan. By the way. This is with my throat for some reason. I don't know. Didn't think anybody was going to notice, though. But, ah, uh, you know. I go back to, like, the New Year's Eve stream because... Uh, go back to the New Year's Eve stream. You can find the exact same thing that happened. <sighs> anyway. Now then, glad you'd advertise Mara's presence in the uh, episode title because you do it. That's exactly what I'd hope you do. Yeah, I mean Mara appeared in the in the the previous the, in the previous parts of the game. It was a mini boss back in Kamoshida's palace. It's just you know that wasn't the real Mara. That was a very uh, it's much smaller version of Mara, which I think I said in the episode really does speak to um, Kamoshida's whole thing, doesn't it? Uh, anyway. <laughs> What a weird, vulgar game sometimes. Uh, in fact, actually quite often. New flavor text? I don't really think it's flavor text. I think it's just giving you uh, more, more, uh, what would you say, information about, more like transparency about how much every single thing is doing in a run. You know, that whole thing. What's new? Well, I'm about to go uh, check, out, check out some of it, but there's like a new room where you can do testing against specific enemies and specific weapons and all that sort of stuff. It is a... It, it's not a lot of big transformative content, but it's still worth checking out. Of course. I mean, like, why not? Dead Cells is the big game after all. So I might as well take a look at every single uh, new update that's coming out and everything. In case you didn't see the comment on last, uh, as much as I suck rec recommending a new save file to master each tech, but I wouldn't blame you. That's a big order. I mean, the problem at this point in time is that I have uh, completely finished Horizon, which is why I'm just like, ah, whatever. Let's just keep going on with it as it is for right now. Still not a good series, but it's like, hey, at least it's, um, what do I think of TikTok? I like it. We did an entire thing talking about um, the Castaways song in the last episode of Horizon, if you wanted to go check that one. 
Have you wanted the super mutations on? No, I'm going to do that uh, for actual, like, recording of episode style stuff. Because this is right now, this is just kind of the burner run that I'm doing while uh, notification is getting sent out for for um, the people on Twitch, basically. You know how that goes, where it's like usually people have like a starting soon screen or something like that, but I don't. I instead just immediately go into playing the video game. <laughs> Why do I do that? I don't know. It's not like a great idea, but that's what I do. There we are, and... Ah, I missed it, but that's okay. Yeah, easy enough to take care of regardless. And nothing. Okay, well, anyway, what were we talking about here? Super mutations. Yeah, that's another thing they apparently added. This enti this idea that, at least when you're testing out stuff, there are um, extremely powerful versions of mutations that you can use to try and... Uh, when you're testing things. If, if you feel like uh, going trying your hand perhaps at specific bosses which is in all likelihood what I'm going to end up doing more than more often than not like I think you know the exact boss that I'm talking about that we're going to be fighting for this entire stream I don't know if that's possible I would think that probably is I, mean, I don't know I don't, why not but um we'll see if Chris uh, Chess w w said punch me daddy would you still take the loot I mean I do that's what they say That's what did. That's that's what it happens to be. Okay, well, let's um. I suppose should probably go start up. Actually, yeah, did practice so no more saves coming. Basically, that's that's the that's the the long and short of it, which I think is fair considering that this is other. Oh, just sends you right out of the room now. Hmm, nice. Uh, what was I talking about here? Um. Right, right, right. No more saves coming because this is a game where if you die, you die. It's that's like the entire the entire dealio. And yeah, there there are just the patch notes right there. So if you are looking for doing it, um, that thing, that practice mode. Yep, that is explicitly what they did. That's basically what the uh, what the what the most of uh, at least from what I understand, most of the uh, the new. They also now have a world map. Really? I mean, it's a, it's an island. That's a, this is known. Come on, you can't just like shoot backwards. That's not how that works. Yeah, it's fine. Okay, well, let's do this one then. How broken is the collector syringe? It's not really broken anymore. It's still extremely. Oh man, it's still extremely powerful. <laughs> Sag. Oh, come on. We were going to start up the actual episode here anyway. All right. Ah, let's do it in five, four, three, two. New alpha. And this time we're going to be getting a practice mode and like super mutations and apparently something resembling a world map. I'm not entirely sure, but from what I've seen, everything's pretty much right at the start of the game. So let's take a look. I think that this is eventually just going to turn out to be a fighting the scarecrow for a full hour part two or... <laughs> Three, as the case may be, considering part two just never really made it to YouTube. I guess this would be the the, the world map, right? Well, let's go sell one of the starting items and see what that looks like. Uh, I don't know if I'm even going to be able to keep any of this stuff after uh, I go into the doors down there, but I guess we'll see. In the meantime, 2,500 gold. Let's take a look. Oh, no, this just shows me all of my items. I don't know. I guess it's like the Viewmaster thing. Yes, there's no window out here or something, but still. I, of course, have everything unlocked because I'm a pro gamer, but you you, you all knew that. Hi. Nothing? Nothing at all. Well, uh, maybe that's going to be coming out in another update for the, the Alpha soon enough. Why do you have to pay for that? I don't know. Yeah, I forgot also that it's like now that we did a burner run here, I did have like 2,000 gold rather than just the, 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 the single gold that would have been required. It's the whole thing related to... Hey, what's this? These are some interesting looking enemies. But, uh... 
Not really ones that actually appear in the game yet. Hey, that's dumb. <laughs> All right, what's up? No, no talking? Ah, I think everything's broken for right now. Well, I guess we'll see it later. Hmm, what to do, what to do? Survival? Survival has been... Oh, nice. Uh, survival has been pretty good for me, at least as of recent. But... I don't know. Now, come on. Super mutations. I was told about super mutations in some way. Give it to me. Wherever they might be. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Who killed the tutorial knight? I don't know. It's like, that's that's never been something explained. Uh, presumably, it's just, I don't know, <laughs> one of the random zombies in the first area. Generally, how that, <laughs> generally how I would think that probably goes. At least that's my experience with Dead Cells. And then, um, what to do, what to do. Armadillo pack is usually what you, what you want to take, but I wasn't able to put the, the thing in the backpack. Oh, no, there we go. Why was not doing that before? Well, anyway, uh, get as many powerful things as possible, and then maybe it's somewhere else that I need to go to do go do the whole... Uh-huh. Uh-huh. What, what, what are these supposed to do? Not even entirely sure. Castle? Huh. She was bad at the game, has to get good. I mean, that is always true. But, you know, a, a, a lot of people... These appear to be the bosses, at least. Okay. So what exactly do I do to open those up is the question. Because I have a very specific... Ah, nothing's working. Come on. Because <laughs> I have a very specific thing that... I would like to be fighting right now. Okay. Probably kill them. Select a mob. What do you got? Mm-hmm. 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 <laughs> ah. Some things didn't quite get translated. It's alpha. You know how that is. Oven Knight's still there, though. Ah, come on. Give me something a little bit more interesting here. Oh, I, I see. So, I guess what I'm supposed to be able to do is select something. Let's say zombie. Sure. And activate it. Yeah, can I get all of them? No, not quite. There's one. Ah, Kevin, I had that. I, I think I might have to jump like a little bit to really get that working for me. But that's uh, got it. Okay, yeah, it's just like you gotta mash down both the hit and the roll at the same time. Ah, yeah, it's the sort of thing that this is. This is how I originally played Dead Cells when it first came out. I would like literally sit in front of enemies and have them attack me, and get the there we are, and get like the timing down and everything like that. Because at the time, of course, the game was pretty difficult to kind of acclimate to, even without the whole boss cells and everything, and making sure that I really understood how everything worked. Same thing with, like, Dead Cells and all that. If you have a really difficult game, I do think that just the slightest bit of practice like this is important. Especially when it's like, you die, you have to restart everything. That's why I like seeing this sort of thing. There were also a bunch of uh, various... Ah, a bunch of various um, uh, uh, mods throughout the times for, like, doing boss rushes and everything like that. So, this is a very welcome addition. The only thing that I would like to see, of course, would be... And if I switch it here. Uh, the only thing, of course, I would like to see for this would be to... Go and get the bosses right now <laughs> more than anything else. Still, it is very alpha. At least, it, it seems for right now, because... Needless to say, uh, nobody's able to talk for me, and things seem to be sort of funky in how they are happening. Okay, a little bit more into, like, the entire amount of enemies around here. Not teleporting to me, though, so I guess maybe the boss cells are not actually active, at least just yet. 
Yo, environments as well? I mean, presumably, this might be like the super early version of, of what they're kind of planning to do for... <laughs> Look how Armadillo Pack works with that sort of... Uh, no, no, no. Wait, they are, they are teleporting. I don't know why they weren't doing that for, like, a little bit here. Right. I'm sure there's going to be, like, a lot more specific choices and whatnot that, that you can make. And, you know, things will be fixed in general. This literally came out yesterday as far as... Like, the, the new alpha. And I guess it's, it's, it's very much in, like, a... Uh, uh, unfinished form for the time being. Also, just use this right now. Can I... Yeah. I guess the biome preset does actually change. It changed the enemies here. I thought it was going to change the background or something. Well, here. Let's take a look. Previous patch dropped for consoles? I have no idea, I'm going to be honest. Select mob here. What do we got over here now? And I can get, like, the the crab men. I don't know about that, though. Generally, uh, fright. But, hey, you can probably create some very interesting combinations here. There we are. Armadillo Pack still remains, like, one of the best, uh, of the various backpack mutations that you can get right now. That said, would also like to get some music or something here, too. It feels just kind of, like, weird being entirely silent and then, um, you know, just the sound effects. I don't know. Does anybody uh, <laughs> have any suggestions right now? I'm open for throwing on um, some sort of terrible meme in the background. The DK rap. No. Uh. All right. Now, the real question, though, is how do I activate... The bosses, because that's what I want. Maybe that's what we can do instead, like go and save scum some stuff if things aren't quite entirely functional for the time being. Get some practice in regardless. Make it the practice stream. RuneScape, Deathclock, Deet Dude. Well, that's Sea Shanty too, yes, from, from the... The... Oh, it's called the dojo, I just noticed. Uh, this sea Shanty 2 from, from, you know. Yeah. <laughs> the, uh, thing. Maybe these things are just going to open up as I get to them. Because in the, in the actual run, what I did was I, I went through to the, whatever this thing is called here, uh, Corrupted Prisons. And maybe that's why they're the only ones that are currently available for me to get to. So, sure. I think that, yeah, I can maybe, like, uh, just go do a quick run. See if I can't get to most parts of the game and have everything unlocked there, then. Why not? Anybody, anybody got any recommendations for a, uh... Uh, a, a run or anything like that that I should be doing right now because I'm open for basically anything as long as it could possibly get me to the ah sure as long as it could possibly get me to the um it, it could work as a run basically full tactics I suppose that would be something I need to change my interact button in the control settings to speak to the NPCs oh let's see if that actually works then uh, interact button. What do we got? What do we got? Uh, use, heal. I guess, like, interact would be this. Then, fine, let's go with, uh, uh I don't know. L, L3? That's not really used for much of anything else. And see if that actually makes a difference for right now. Could be one of those funky things where... A lot of this has been like tested on keyboard or something initially, and that has, needless to say, a lot more key bindings than using a a controller. Nope. Still not doing it. Magic Missile Run? You know, it's been a while since I've done a Magic Missile Run. Maybe we'll do a little bit of that. Seems like that could be fun. But yeah, turn... 
back on everything from I don't even remember what the last run that I was doing was it, yeah it was that very specific uh yeah this one this one that's right okay let's go turn off everything magic missile what else would work well with magic missile how about you um I that's about it though right then we can just kind of like keep everything as it were. Ooh, new outfits. Flawless. I see. Huh. All right. Well, sure. <laughs> it seems like that might be at least fun to see for right now. And then uh, alternate binding profile? What does that mean? Using custom mode. Da, 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 da. Huh. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. They're still trying to uh, push that whole deal then, I see. All right. Let's see what's going on. How hard did Magic Missile get nerfed? I don't really see why it would be nerfed, to be honest, because there's a lot of... You you really got to get a good run going to make it truly amazing. But as, yeah, I wonder how we unlock those. Oh, and they look so, so beautiful. <laughs> they? Well, anyway... Can worry about making that one work a little bit later. In the meantime, Magic Missile and trying to see if I can't get a really good run going. Like I said, it's an item that requires pretty high stats, a pretty good run going. But once it goes, it goes. And I feel confident that I can make that work. Sure, sure. We'll, we'll see how it happens, though. It's so gaudy. I love the gaudy outfits. The only thing that I ask, of course, would be that they do, in fact, like, have a glowing shine to them. Like, they, they will... I, I, I don't know if there's much of a lighting engine when it comes to dead cells, but... Come on, give me some reflectiveness. That's what I want to see when it comes to using these outfits. If I'm going to get, you know... The, the DLC pre-order version of each one of the 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 boss outfits they better like shine shine as bright as the sun when I'm using them in 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 any one of the runs of course see how I glitter exactly I want to be you know cover myself in gold become the hedonism bot uh, in human form that I that I've always known that I've been Come on, that is exactly how I would describe myself. But uh, as of right now, you know, let's just say alpha and uh, assume that it's probably going to be changed later on. Look, we got stuff like the, the neon outfit. We got stuff like the, the festive outfit, everything like that. Certainly it is not out of the reach of, of Motion Twin to put in very silly, stupid looking outfits. I don't know. It didn't really seem like they had, and they didn't. Ha they had like the five cell, uh, the five cell boss outfits there to be unlocked. Just the, the, the traditional like four ones, and I guess you know, like let, let me go see real quick. What were what were the exact outfits that they had here available for me? Uh, yeah, yeah. Concierge, Conjunctivius, Hand of the King, and Giant. And just a good job. <laughs> Thanks. I feel very accomplished. But I'm, I'm sure that, yeah. T t what What is the... No Flawless Mama Tick outfit, though, which is unfortunate. Poison heals instead of wounding you. I think that kind of is about to set the course for this run now, isn't it? All right. I like the Berserk aspect. Oh, yeah, I haven't found the aspects yet. I was I was looking around for those, but never saw them. Uh, where do you actually get those things or unlock them or whatever it is you do to to, to make those, those whole deals work? Because I was told we are supposed to have some sort of form of super mutations. Where do they appear? Where are they at? Because I couldn't find them. Guy to the left of the training room. Oh, everything's broken, though. I wasn't able to um, actually talk to him and uh, or any of the NPCs, at least in this uh, in this version of the game right now. No idea why that is, but yeah, broken alphas, exactly. <laughs> it's like, what, what more do I need to say? It's an alpha. Things may not work super great. You have to load an old save for everything to work. 
but they they force you to use in in alphas. They force you to use the uh, uh, experimental save file. At least that's how it's always gone up to this point. Strange. I'm definitely going to take some cooldown reduction, seeing just how absolutely ridiculous it seems like having corrupted power is working for me there. Mm-hmm. Maybe try with keyboard. I tried rebinding everything, but it didn't quite... Uh... Hey, they got rid of that? Or maybe I just didn't find it? Did... Whatever, it doesn't matter. Let's just uh, get on with this here for right now. <laughs> Look, I want to make sure that I have everything unlocked first, and then we can start messing about with uh, other weird nonsense. Because like I said, the plan is supposed to be... Uh, Hunter's Instinct, please. Uh, the plan is supposed to be that I want to have one very specific boss unlocked so that I can practice against them. You have to import and copy a live save. Oh, rather than you... Ah, whatever. We'll f figure it out later. Why magic missile so strong? It's probably because I'm just using corrupted power. I mean, otherwise, it's not like it's an extremely powerful weapon. And, you know, it's the first area. And I will say that just, like, magic missile's great. Uh, the whole, like, tracking onto enemies and being able to hit them from basically any point that you're at, period. It, it, the theoretical DPS is much uh, closer to... The actual DPS you're getting, because in a an open area, you just hold down the attack button and you will hit an enemy, period. But usually the DPS and the lack of having a critical or anything kind of makes it so it's not, like, truly amazing. You know, that it's just instead pretty good. Here, the hope is that I'll have a good enough... Come on now. The hope is that I'll have a good enough run going to make it extremely strong eventually we'll see how that how that actually shakes out though comparatively and then if it does have an easy time go unlock all of these outfits legitimately basically rather than have them just because of the, the complete save file if not well I'll probably die swiftly and horrible oh so yeah come on magic missile's cool you get a uh, Shoots out little magical balls that get um, increasingly powerful as you you gain levels. So uh, it is a standard sort of spell to be used in any sort of wizard build in a in a Dungeons and Dragons, if you will. <laughs> doesn't work with barb tips. That's true. It doesn't have a uh, doesn't have the the ability to have ammo. So, it is a magic spell, as you would expect. Quality of life weapon. True. No bee enemies also. That is also true. I don't know what that means in the context of this, but yes. Standing in poison for 10 minutes stream? Think of it as a... This is the, this is the Dead Cells equivalent of a hot tub stream. <laughs> like, come on. I think that, that that makes a lot of sense, if you think about it. There we go. Look, I explicitly went in here because I have the ability to, you know, heal from poison. It's like this you don't really get a whole lot of a whole lot of uh, uh, chances to truly use that affix to its maximum ability. It's, uh, it's usually one that becomes useless after the first two areas. If you get in the first area, why not? Why not? Now right anyway. Should do a rogue series? Are you talking about like rogue, the rogue like rogue? Oh man, that'd be interesting. But you know, rogue, I I've played it before. Like I have, I have, I have experienced that. I've also played many games, you know, many like true rogue likes and everything that very much do play like that. It's just rogue is very rough. I mean, it would be pretty much me kind of like struggling to. Uh, do much of anything until I find a scroll of all knowledge and then uh, beat the game easily. <laughs> Is it not just the worst net hack? I mean, hack, which eventually became net hack, was originally created as uh, because Rogue was was proprietary software that was created as the like a uh, open source alternative. Same thing with uh, uh, same thing with uh, whatever became Angband. What what is that game? What was that game called? Can't remember. It's 
it, it had a, a very different name. Uh, you know what I'm talking about, though. Or maybe you don't. I mean, these are... This is, these are some, like, you know, 70s video games, but you know what I'm saying. 70s video game history. What's new? Well, I mean, of course, as you can see right now, flawless outfits. Beating the game, beating an enemy flawlessly now gives you a very gaudy, ugly looking version of the, the, the boss outfit. But also, um, a number of things related to basically practice areas. You can now practice against uh, enemies, groups of enemies, all that sort of stuff. Instead of, um, you know, hoping and praying that you don't die and lose all of your progress in five cells mode because one death restarts you over at the beginning. It's something that I appreciate a lot, especially for the sake of bosses. Fortunately, it does seem like I have to get to the boss first before I am able to practice against them, which is exactly what I'm doing right now. Also, in the meantime, we're talking about classic roguelikes. <laughs> That's just... That, that has nothing to do with the update or anything. It's just uh, one of those things where I just kind of say whatever I want to throw off the filters for the streams, and then we... We just chat about whatever. Want a Scarecrow Flawless Outfit? I mean, it's like I would have gotten the Scarecrow. I, I did that with the um, the certain spinning weapon run. But, of course, because I had that unlocked at the beginning. Oh, we don't get the achievement. And, of course, the outfit wasn't even implemented at the time. It's just still. Scarecrow has low health. Good tactics run. Can smoke him. Well, yeah, I mean, that's also true for, like, the... Uh, the um giant for example you can just uh get him in a cycle of having his hands destroyed followed by being able to totally clown on him and all you need is just a good well magic missile would of course do it i mean go check out my another magic missile run video now with less um ear piercing weird audio glitches <laughs> that, that, that took me like six months or something to realize uh but you know uh also just a good Good turrets work out well. Good turrets will smoke most bosses. I mean, there's there's few ones that don't quite uh, fall to to just overwhelming damage in that way. That whole thing. I recently found out that rogue is an actual game and not just a genre. Yeah, it, they're called rogue likes for a reason. In the same way that we refer to uh, those you know games where you you shoot people in first person as doom likes. <laughs> it's it. Yo, it's like it's it's a classic game. I think that a lot of the games that were inspired by it kind of surpass it. That's that's uh my my like you know in a nutshell opinion on the subject basically. That happens with a lot of games, you know? Where after decades of of game design often do lead to like a a more complete product compared to the things that originally inspired them. Not always, though. Okay, come on. Tactics still also has the issue of dying in, like, a single hit if you get hit at all in a... Or as we call games uh, inspired by Dark Souls, Dark Likes. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I don't... People keep trying to make Souls like a thing, and I'm just like, it just... It's just an action RPG, basically, and that's... an. Art, and you know that that describes many video games at this point in time. Like I've, I've been described, like I described that one episode or my entire playthrough of Horizon Zero Dawn as me playing it like Dark Souls. It ain't like Dark Souls. Aloy will just will magnetize to the nearest enemy in a way that like Dark Souls certainly would never do. Also, needless to say, a lot of uh, other mechanics just don't really align to make that true at all. <laughs> ah, it's not the same deal, Persona-like. <laughs> I mean, there are games that I would kind of like compare to Persona in that way. You remember like uh, Digimon Cyber Sleuth? Remember like World Ends With You? It's got that sort of feel to it. Well, actually, World Ends With You is sort of uh, That's almost more like Jet Set Radio. But obviously the gameplay is closer. It's just, uh, I don't know. Even as a name, roguelikes, I think are just like, <laughs> it's a silly name, but especially because uh, 
it's applied to so many other games that are very much not like Rogue anymore. Anyway, this is my curmudgeonly old man uh, genre rant yet again. <laughs> now then, you should replace pasta. <laughs> you know, pa look, if I start a game, I finish it. And that includes... That includes, like, uh, replacements are still our new games. I'm going to finish all of them. All of them will be finished. Old man yells at video games. Yeah, well, you know, that's me. I'm I'm both an old man and a and, well, I'm not a video game. What is what would that what does that even mean? But you know what I'm saying here. All right, getting that corrupt prison. What about the terrible title of Metroidvania? But I don't know if you've I don't know if anybody ever notices, but I never say Metroidvania. I always say Metroid like. <laughs> Just outright. Because Castlevania was not a part of that equation until Symphony of the Night, which was like 20 years after. Well, okay, it was like 10 years after uh, Metroid came out. It was close. It, it's closer. Do you remember, like, yeah, there's so many other games that are better fits as far as, like, comparisons. But people are like, mm, we're going to shove Metro. We're, we're going to shove Metroid right in with... with no, this is some real old man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay. You're right. You're right. When you're right, you're right. Just give me t uh, just give me um, turret thing. I don't like that name. <laughs> Even though I very much do like the Castlevania games. I mean, I'm playing this game for God's sake. Yeah, but Symphony of the Night is busting. I don't, I don't think I don't like Symphony of the Night that much, to be honest. Like compared to a lot of the other Castlevania games, that's like one of my least favorite of that uh, particular style. Which is probably, like, almost nigh-on heretical to say for... Um... Yeah, sure. For right now, at least. It's probably, like, nigh-on heretical to say, but... What can I say? It's just, like, I think it did subsequent entries that were of that style improved on it a lot. I also don't like Metroid-style games. I mean, this is this is known. Bussin'. Bussin', 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 makes me feel good. Uh, any questions? <laughs> so you're not playing the new Metroid then? Probably not. I mean, I, I like Metroid. Played, um, quite a few of them. But, like, I don't know, it just, it's not my favorite type of... Yeah, that was close. It's not my favorite type of genre. Okay. And before you're like, well, yeah, well, you like Dead Cells. It's like Dead Cells does not have any exploration in it. It is very much level based. And there we are. Okay. Also, it's just like it's not like I. It's not like it's completely antithetical for me to like open world or exploration games. <laughs> it's just. I, I did just, just not a prefer uh, that's just not a, a preference and usually the the open world aspect of it This really is old man complains about video games. Why this turn into the old man complains about video game stream? I hate it. You did this to me chat. Oh There we are Ugh. Donkey Kong Doc busting on stream. Well, yeah, I mean man, I'm about to bust. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, and, and that's me. Hank walked in on me. Come on. Uh, it became the old man complains about video games when you click the start streaming button. No, he can, he, it became the old man enjoys a new alpha of a game he likes. <laughs> that's what it became. You made it, you, you're the ones that made it weird. Oh, come on. Uh, everything, everything is shielded too. Ah, oh, damn. Ah, well. The the protector is really just totally destroying me there. Yeah, that was expected. Yeah, it's because I it's because I didn't d kill every single enemy in the area, right? Oh, why did you kill every single enemy in the area? Because they were shielded. People without eyes. Let's see if this guy's working. There we are. 
All right. Slowly heals you when a gas cloud poison. Poison no longer affects you. Those cooldowns one second. Okay. Hmm, jump back and forth. Interesting. Blood drinker. Hmm. All right. This is, yeah, this is pretty... Uh, Instantly kills any non-boss target. That doesn't really seem like a very good thing. Curse chest spawn rate, but double the damage you receive and deal. Wow, that's extremely powerful. Hmm. Plus 25% per biter. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, yeah, that seems interesting. I don't know which one exactly I would want, but uh meantime we can still get this working though. What do I want here? I don't know. Pick damned with cursed sword. I mean I guess yeah. It'll probably work. What the hell aspects? I don't know which one to take though. That's the thing. Like, what one would be the optimal to try and take, at least as of right now? Also, they do seem just extremely strong, every one of them. Speaking of Cursed Sword, well, I guess we're doing this now. <laughs> All right, let's see how it goes. Busting. Biters do a biter run. Biter run would be interesting. The menagerie uh, aspect. I don't know, though. Still, the goal here was to try and go unlock some bosses. But, uh, it's, I don't know. Unlock some bosses for the stuff. But, you know, it's just like, they're directed towards less hardcore players. So, you know. <laughs> I keep saying, every single time, I keep saying, it's just like, don't make video games for me. And they kept making this video game for me. And I'm just like, thank you. But also, stop making this video game for me. So, it's nice to see some more. Yeah. They're basically legal cheats added to the game, which, you know, good. <laughs> Once again. Doc, I started watching the Persona episodes, and now I like you less as a human being. Hey, why, why is that, though? Don't you like me more as a human being? Because it's like, you, you know, I'm the only one brave enough to, to school on Persona. Right? 800 to hit in the first area. I should probably just stop the rec the, the the video recording. I'm gonna have to hack this one together later. Um, what are we doing here? Uh, what was I doing here? Uh, right, right, biters, 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 only biters. 100% biters run. Um, and then. Yeah, any, anything else you want to see? I, I guess, like, yeah, yeah, Owl would probably also be a good one if we're doing pets. Uh, other pets would be Mushroom Boy, Serenade, but they don't really scale. Like the Biters. Only Biters run? We can do, we can do all the Biters run. Who's ready for Only Biters meme run? <laughs> Yeah, come on, man. Most only talk about the underage toe man. <laughs> to to toe man? <laughs> it's not a meme if it works. We'll see if it works. I'll judge this. I mean, you know, aspect based runs, though, would be something for, uh. Would be something for like a fun meme run type of thing going on here. I mean, after all, it's like I only got the uh, the cursed sword left. But um, yeah, still gotta do that. I said that I was going to do that, and then I didn't do that. All right. Oh, well, let's see how this happens. I'll. I don't know. Yeah, they're still bad. I know. Ugh, Toe Man, the worst superhero, or the best superhero, depends on what you what, what you're thinking. 
Like, I don't know. You, you, you into it? I mean, I'm just asking chat here. This is a completely innocent question, of course. Ah. <laughs> uh. Yo, Biter, you gotta, like, start doing stuff here. No, can't hit invisible enemies, apparently. Hmm. I mean, certainly the inability for, uh... For, um, invisible enemies to be hit at all by these guys is frustrating. It was supposed to be a romance. To uh, would you romance Toes, chat, if you had the chance? Just asking for a friend. I think you know who that friend is. Me. Stream is now cursed. I already turned off the, rec the video recording, you know. Because it's just like we got to, we got to, um, you know, actually get to, like, to the unlocking stuff first. You know the answer is yes when Chad has asked for feet many times. By the way, that was a new thing that uh, somebody asked for in the comments, which was uh, feet reveal if I, um... If I get to 100,000 subs. Well, so how about this? Uh, feet reveal if I get to, um, I don't know, 1,000 subs on, on Twitch. How about that? Is that what you want, you sickos? My doc's friend? Of course you are. I hate it here. <laughs> uh, this is the contract that you signed when you came into the stream. Here, let me see. Uh, there must be a law against that. No, ain't no laws when you're drinking claws. White claws. Let me see. What does, what like, my Twitch stats currently say? Uh, I have nine, 90 subscribers right now, which is pretty nice. <laughs> Thanks, everybody, by the way. Uh, but it's just like, if I could get to 1,000, feet reveal. Nice. Even though that's... you. You, you did it wrong? Where's my second skill? This is a two-handed weapon. 90 subs, 3.2k followers. Uh, yeah, yeah. 3.2? Actually, no, I only got, uh, 3,178. And actually, somebody just, just subscribed this, or somebody just, um, followed the second that I said that. Thank you, anonymous, um, follower. I love you. Well, mm, that's for subs, though. Do I want to commit to that sort of love? Chat, yeah, tell me. Here, what if I just, like, exit out for one second and then, uh, get back in? Isn't that the carbine? Well, no, it's not the carbine. This is the, this is the repeater crossbow. But it, it did not give me the second, the second weapon. What's up with that? Whoa, what was that? Loading there for a second. Um, strange. Biter's aspect only buffs you, not the, wait, wait, what? That's how it works? Uh, deals one, plus 100% per active pet. Huh. Well, because that's that was the point of taking. Wait, what? Hmm. Plus one hundred percent doesn't say only me. It says. Hmm. Get a better PC, you clown. What? That's not a PC thing. That's an alpha thing, clearly. <laughs> that's that's a, the, the 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 alpha male grind set. Sure. Hey, any alpha males in chat? Get get one anyway. No, I don't want to spend the money. <laughs> um, what are we even looking at right now? I, I probably should have actually taken that one. It seems like it has a better uh, synergy going on. on. On Twitch? Yes. Only on Twitch. Huh. Okay, well, bye. <laughs> Sigma male is where it's at. Yeah, I mean, I'm always on the Sigma male grind set. As you all know, I'm the biggest proponent of both Sigma, the final boss of many of the Mega Man X series, and also uh, males. Lower FPS gives you more time to be better. What do you mean? Uh, 
we're gonna have to go um restart the stream everybody i'm sorry <laughs>